I think you made him mad. <laughs> Can't we just all get along? I mean, don't you get it, Ben? Don't you see what's going on here? Yeah, sort of. Not really. <laughs> Look, man, it doesn't matter how I acted. All right, and the only reason we're even in jail is because a cop saw a dark-skinned man in an expensive car. Are you serious? You really think I look that tan? <laughs> go Marlins rain out you can't lose if you don't play <laughs> uh, here's a real team the Cardinals let's go McGuire hit one out for the last time Sue shopping is not a competition oh yeah I got a better dress for half the price no you didn't yes I did dad <laughs> what do you think of my dress that's wonderful, honey. What do you think of mine? That's wonderful, honey. Dad, your head's on fire. That's wonderful, honey. Dad, come on. Which dress do you think is better? I love you both. I can't choose, even if I do like Marcy's better. <laughs> oh, what do you know about dresses, old man? <sighs> Dad, I'm tired of this stupid fighting. It's getting really old, and I want things back to normal. We don't do normal in this house. <laughs> I'm just tired of having to compete at everything. What should I do? Mars, Sue's used to winning. She needs to learn how to be a good loser. Well, I've given her enough chances. Should I keep beating her until she catches on? No, I want you to let her win at something before I miss the entire baseball season. <laughs> I can't believe you found my car. How can I ever repay you? You can start by letting go. <laughs> Sorry, big guy. Officer. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> well, um, I want to see the dirtbags who stole my car face to face. Right this way. Oh, Craig, Jane. Ben, Neil. Man, it's weird being on this side of the bars. <laughs> Man, are we so glad to see you. You know them? Oh, yeah, I know them real well. Mm -hmm. Now lock them up for life. <laughs> Craig, Craig, wait. You do the crime, you do the time, fellas. I have always wanted to say that. You want to press charges? I only want what's fair. Does Florida have the electric chair? <laughs> Need you to fill out some paperwork to get your car back. Neil, I'm so disappointed. Stealing a car is crazy, but stealing a car with Ben as your lookout is just plain stupid. <laughs> We didn't do anything wrong. We were just sitting in Gray's car. Yeah, the cop started hassling us when he saw Neil in the driver's seat. Because you're black? No, because I'm a cock spaniel. <laughs> oh, Jane, this guy's racist. All right, Craig, you've had your fun. Time to drop the charges. Why? Because if you don't, Ben and Neil could end up behind bars for a long time. Help me out, because I'm not seeing the downside to that. <laughs> Listen. Well, you know what? I'm not going to press charges, and I'm taking my hug back. That's the way you want it. You're free to go. Man, I am so glad this is over. Hold on. You're staying here. What, what for? I'm sure this isn't your first run-in with the law, Mr. Smith. Being held here till your criminal record clearance comes back. Hey, that's not fair. You're making this up. Standard operating procedure. Like I said, you fit a profile. What profile? That I'm young and black? Well, as far as I know, that's not against the law. I can hold you for 72 hours, smart guy. You better straighten up before I find a reason to hold you here for a lot longer. Let's go. <laughs> Isn't it nice having the place all to ourselves for a change? Yeah, it's so peaceful. Let's enjoy it while we can. Oh, uh, yeah. Dad! Karen! Well, that was fun. <laughs> You've got to go get Neil out of jail. A racist cop won't let him use the phone. Yeah, he locked me up, too. And it's all my fault. I thought the car was stolen, but it wasn't, and now we may never see Neil again. So let me get this straight. What? <laughs> a cop saw Neil and me in Cray's car He took us in because he thought we were trying to steal it He let Ben go, but he's keeping Neil yeah, And he's doing it because Neil's African-American Are you sure about that? Trust me, Neil's African-American <laughs> Well, wasn't that fun? Fun? I won every 
upset. No matter how bad I played, you played worse. It was like you were trying to lose. Well, there are more important things in life than winning a tennis match. Wow, that serve I bounced off your head must have rattled the one marble you've got in there. <laughs> Do you think I am so shallow I can only be happy when I win? Totally. <laughs> I don't get it. Why would you let your racket fly out of your hand and not go after it? Excuse me, Sue. This uh, landed in my court. I think it's yours. Oh, thanks, Bernard. Any more questions? <laughs> I'm sorry, my swing is all wrong. I could really use a lesson or two. Well, I give lessons. Get out. <laughs> hey, maybe you could give me a few lessons sometime. Sure, is uh, tomorrow? Perfect. <laughs> all right, I'll see you then. Oh. oh, well, well, well. Looks like it's Marcy, zero, Sue, love. <laughs> We're uh, Dave and Karen Blake. We're here for our son, Neil Smith. You're his parents? Yeah. Is there something wrong with that? No, it's just that he doesn't look like... a Blake. <laughs> I'd like to see the report. Sure thing. Yeah, we picked him up on... suspicion of Grand Theft Auto. Hmm. It says here you picked Neil up at 2.30. According to this, our other son, Cray, didn't report his car stolen until 4 o'clock. Really? Yeah. It's a little funny that you arrested Neil for stealing a car an hour and a half before it was reported stolen. Must have been a typo or something. Hmm. You're gonna have to do better than that, Bob. And don't mess with a pregnant woman. I get angry for two. Oh, now, you folks know how these things can happen? No, I don't. After you release our son, I'd love for you to explain it to me. You're free to go. Sorry for the misunderstanding. Just. Trying to do my job. Then you should have let me prove that the car was my brother's instead of taking me in on bogus charges. I made a mistake. And I already apologized. Oh, no, you can keep your apology, all right? Because I'm not going to pretend like this didn't happen. I'm going to get a lawyer. Look, maybe you folks can reason with him. Reason with him? We're going to help him. He's just going to stir up trouble. That's what we do. C can we go, please? Neil, you don't want to turn this into a problem. You know, it's people like you that are the problem. All right, you're supposed to serve and protect the community, not intimidate people you don't like. You've never been a cop. It's not easy. No, it isn't. All right, but it's a rotten cop like you that gives all good cops a bad name. Look, you got the wrong idea. I'm not Look, trying to give you... please save your breath. We're going to make sure that you never do this to anybody again. <laughs> you know, that's a shame you're not black. What? Because then you would know how it feels to go up against a cop like yourself. Have a good day.